How's it going, ladies and gents? Reverend St. Peck again with another video for you guys today. What we're going to be talking about is this newly found out, I guess, I don't want to say it's announced, but I found out it's confirmed in a bunch of articles that apparently Activision is going to be releasing a trilogy. Modern Warfare 1, Modern Warfare 2, Modern Warfare 3, not remastered. Just the trilogy, plus the Stimulus Mac pack for Modern Warfare 2 on last gen. Not this gen, not this gen at all. We're getting the remastered Modern Warfare this year, but last gen. Just let that sink in for a second. What? Like, what? <laughs> okay, first of all, I sat here and sat around and I thought I thought about it for a second and I tried to look up some statistics on active user bases on the last gen consoles. I couldn't really find anything that I would uh, deem reliable, but you could probably guess that there is a decent amount of players that are still on the last gen consoles, Xbox 360 and PS3. All right, I I'd venture to say possibly within the, you know, the six digit mark. Possibly more than that, possibly, actually probably closer to the seven digit mark due to the fact that they are doing this. This is 100% something that they are doing for money. They just want more money, they want to milk it for as much as they possibly can. Um, obviously, they haven't been releasing uh, any Call of Duties on Xbox's backwards compatibility program or anything like that. Uh, so why are they doing that? Well, that's because they're not done releasing the same games have already released that people have already bought on the last gen consoles uh, For the consoles, you know that they already have so it's it just oh my god like Look, you guys know I stay positive. You guys know I, I tend to go against the flow of hatred and, and avoid bandwagons, but there's no avoiding that. that. Like, right now, if I supported this, I would legitimately be a D-Rider, like everyone says. But this is uh, something to legitimately be curious about. Like, what the crap, dude? This is such a freaking greedy move, in my opinion. And, and you think about, oh, it doesn't really affect you. You're on Xbox One, you're on a PS4, you're on PC, whatever. It doesn't really affect you. Yeah, but it's still kind of BS, man, uh, that you're going to re-release -re games that are out already that people have had for years re-release them on these same consoles with no upgrades or at least visual upgrades i'm hoping to god that they do multiplayer upgrades they they, they support it more whatever because those games on 360 are hacked to death they are hacked more than they are on PC. I can go back and play my uh, Modern Warfare 1 on PC, no problem. I've uploaded two videos already of it. It's perfectly fine. You can find unhacked uh, uh, servers, no problem. On Xbox 360, it's not that easy. It takes forever to find a game that's not hacked, and by then you're already Master Prestige or, or 10th Prestige over, and you already have all the unlocks and, and whatever, and you've already you've already had the unlocks, got reset, had the unlocks, got reset, and had the unlocks five times over. You know, by the time you find a lobby that's not completely hacked due to people hacking. And to me, it's just like, this just doesn't make any sense to me why they would do this. Like... I don't think they're going to support it. I really don't. I think they're just releasing it. They're saying, here's for the uh, the 10-year-olds who, who couldn't convince their parents to buy them an Xbox One or a PS4. You know, that that's seriously what I feel like this is. I feel like it, they need a way to still support last gen due to the fact that there is still a bunch of people on that console. But the new game, it's too, it's too advanced for last gen. Obviously, Black Ops 3 was too advanced for last gen. Have you seen what Black Ops 3 looks like on last gen? Holy crap, is it bad. It is horrid. It is difficult to look at. Black Ops 1 looked better than this game de does on last gen. And th that is like years ago, dude. Like, it just baffles me that they're, that they're doing this. And, and, and I, I just don't know, man. It honestly makes me a little bit angry. But I guess I kind of wanted to bring this to you guys. Let you guys know this if you didn't already know and get your guys' opinion. What do you guys think of this weird thing, this weird release that they're going to be doing for last gen? Uh, let me know in the comments down below. I know I, there's actually, I still know a lot of people 
uh, who are still on last gen because they just haven't upgraded or they didn't have, have the money at the time and then they just haven't upgraded since, you know? So, to me, I don't know, man. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. That does it for me today. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and a comment. Don't forget to share it with your friends and hit that subscribe button if you have not. And I will see you guys tomorrow for yet another video. Peace!